Hi everyone, I'm here to talk to you about neck bends on the guitar and how they can be a useful technique to make your sound, song sound cooler or maybe add a little flair. Tommy Emanuel does this all the time. I love it. It um, kind of adds that extra touch. Um, I posted a video yesterday, just kind of an on-the-fly video of the tail end of Amazing Grace, the part that kind of goes like this. That neck bend uh, got a lot of comments from people and questions about how that, how that works, how you do it. Um, there's a couple ways you can do it, and I like to either play a chord that rings and then do a neck bend with it, obviously at the right time and place, but, or you can do a harmonic or a set of harmonics. You can kind of so the way this works is you're taking the neck of your guitar and you're pushing it outward while at the same time using this hand to push the body of your guitar inward and you can do that with a chord or a set of notes you could do it with a G chord or you could do it with a harmonics up here anyway the, the way it was used in that song with uh, Tommy Emanuel's song, I believe it's used on an F chord. Or a variation of the F chord, which adds a nice little touch to go into that last E chord. So I hope you enjoy that, I hope it helps you, and I hope that um, you're able to neck bend it up, but be aware there's some controversy over <laughs> how that may or may not be good for your guitar. Ultimately, you don't want to put too much stress on it. Obviously, start very gently. It doesn't take much to actually achieve the effect and no need busting your guitar in half. And uh, I, I don't want to be uh, at fault for that. So <laughs> enjoy and uh, use at your own uh, discretion and uh, have a great day.